And what is this notion that just because most migrants nowadays are brown, I can't criticize mass migration without blaming it on brown people specifically? Like, because you use the word homogenous uh, that everybody use, uses when they're referring to ethnicity, and then you mention IQ right after. So that's why. That's why, Laren. That's why. Don't pretend you don't know that. That's some BS right there. There nope. are tons of amazing immigrants out there who, yeah, are not white and they're very skilled and that's fine, but... Oh, wait, that's fine. Thank you so much. Come on. Mass migration absolutely has cultural and political effects on Western countries. Yes, and it could have a bad effect if, if people are coming in with crappy values. Values and beliefs that are... That's what you need to worry about. Not their ethnicity, not their ethnicity, okay? So when you have migration, it's good for countries if it's done right. And if you manage to get the right skill set that you need, it helps both the both countries, right? If uh, my, migration is great, okay? And more immigration, mo most countries on the planet right now need more immigration, okay? Not less immigration, more immigration. If it's done right, if it's based on certain skill set, if, it's ba if, it's, if it screens for people... Uh, you know, if it with for crappy uh, values, if you make sure that people that are are bringing in their misogyny or homophobia and there's you know and all those other and the anti secularism, um, uh, if you make sure that those people are not allowed in, and if you make sure that the people that you're allowing in are filling in a gap of certain skill sets that your country is not providing right now. It's very good for both the receiving country and the country that is giving them immigrants because a lot of them go back and they bring back to their country certain skill sets that they didn't have before. And while they're inside your country, they're sending money back to their families. So back in the home country. So it's a win, win, win for everybody if immigration is done right. Okay. The problem is that what you should be screening for is values and skill sets. I, un, unless you have a refugee case and you're trying to help people that are in danger, that's a you know that's an exce exception. Um, but yeah, but what should never be the criteria is people's ethnicity. And when you talk about homogenous societies with higher average IQ, people will. Your audience, your mostly right-leaning audience, will be like, if they enjoy that, we know why they enjoy that. We know. We know that they know what you're talking about, and we know what you, that you know what you're talking about. And we know why, why they follow you, because they know what, you're, what exactly you're telling them. And, I mean, I, I don't think that should be off-limits in terms of criticism. Just